Welcome back to the channel guys, it's Wally and today we're going to be listening to a new song by Sabaton. Now if you guys have subscribed over on Sabaton's YouTube channel, you probably saw a couple weeks ago they released a little teaser for a brand new song that was coming out called Soldier of Heaven. Uh, now for me, I didn't listen to the song because I knew I wanted to react to it and like I said before, I really want my reactions to be as genuine as possible. So I've been sitting over here for the past couple weeks being like, okay, I wonder what this video is about. I wonder what the song's about. I wonder what it's gonna sound like. And now the wait is over. The video is released and I'm ready to watch it. So I'm gonna cut the intro short, but before we get into the video, if you are new here, just haven't yet, please make sure to go down and hit the subscribe button. And if you do enjoy the video, make sure to drop a like too. Well, let's get into the song. I gotta say just quickly um i know i know yarn hub the, the guys who did the um like the animated music videos uh the couple ones that we've watched already um i gotta say i know they didn't do anything in this video but i, I gotta commend them because watching these music videos and watching you know uh the way they are when they're uh when they're actually performing uh they do a really good job of representing that in like their videos in like the yarn hub videos so Kudos to them because that's that's pretty incredible. But this song is pretty effing awesome to begin with. I love kind of like that driving beat. I like that. I don't know if that was kind of like a synth in the drum in the beginning. Uh, I think that sounds really cool. Um, dude, his voice is just so damn powerful. Every damn time he comes in. Like it just kind of hits you right in the chest. It, it, it's a beautiful thing. And, and the video too. I love how they have like... Because you could see it there, like, right at the end of the chorus. Like, you could definitely see, like, the spirit kind of moving amongst them and all that. But, like, even earlier in the video, too, like, you can get little glimpses of them, like, in the background while they're performing. Um, and I think that's just a really cool touch. Um, it's, a, it's a really cool song, though. And I, I really like the location they chose for this, too. It's really beautiful. damn powerful I mean uh, okay I'm sorry because I want to listen to this guitar solo it, this video is just so powerful like even the song itself like take the video away this the song is so powerful too like I it's it's incredible but you throw this video in and holy cow like I, I know this is something I talked about a couple videos ago and it's something I know you guys talk about in the comments all the time which I, I obviously completely agree with, is that their music videos are absolutely incredible. Like, um, a, a lot of the bands that we've been listening to, like, lately on here, uh, we've been watching a lot of, like, live, you know, performances and all that because 
their live performances are pretty dope. And we've listened to a live a live song by Sabaton before, and they are really, really awesome live too. I'm not taking anything like that away from them, but these music videos, they produce them so perfectly. And they just, they really tell that story that the song's kind of telling, and it just really reinforces it too. Which is why I say it's a very, very powerful thing. Like you watch it and you truly feel like you're there. You feel the emotions that they're, that they're feeling when they're playing. And it's not something that you get from a lot of bands and a lot of music videos. So it, it just makes me really appreciate them just all that much more. It's, it's incredible. It is. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I want to go back and listen to that again because that that was a short solo. It really was. M maybe I just haven't had my fix of like serious solos lately. Like we've had some really great ones that we've listened to uh, recently on here, but maybe just in my everyday life when I'm not reacting to things, I haven't had enough guitar solos, but that, that, that was really dope. It was short, but it was perfect. It was sweet. It, it, was, it was really incredible. And I love, it looked like he was tapping a little bit in the beginning too. And just the noise that like the taps make and all that just that that's what okay no i'm not going to say that but it, it's a really cool thing that's one of my favorite sounds that a guitar uh, that a guitar can make and that's uh that's part of the reason why i love like buckethead steve Vai, john petrucci and guys like that because they really implement that in like their playing style and to hear it here too is it's it's incredible i want to hear that one more time it looked like he was tapping at least Regardless, a dope solo. That's beautiful. Dedicated to all those unknown heroes who never came home. That is beautiful. And I, I sorry to keep sounding like a broken record there, calling the song beautiful, but that it really was. Um, like I said before, that was, that was, it's a really, really powerful song too. Um, and again, the fact it's dedicated to all those heroes who never came home. It's you know. They are. They're soldiers of heaven. And it sucks that, um, I mean, it's rough that, you know, they never got the chance to come home or some of them that just were, you know, I guess never, I guess found either. And it's, it's a sad thing, but those people definitely need to be, definitely need to be remembered, even if they obviously didn't come home. But really that, uh, that song was so beautiful. It, it really, really was definitely, like I said, very powerful. Um, that guitar solo in there. I, I love that. Again, it was short and sweet. But it just fits so well with the song, and oh, it was so great. And you know, this is what our fourth song that we've listened to by them on this channel, uh, and I still haven't learned all their names and all that. And I feel effing horrible for that because uh, they they definitely deserve it. They were really really incredible, and I am going to continue to listen to them here. But uh, but no, dude, his voice is just so so incredible. It, it really really is, and it really is extremely very impactful very powerful i love the the bass that he has in his voice too it's it's dude it hits me right here it really does like i said in the beginning like it just kind of hits you right in the chest hits you right in the face um it, it's a really cool thing but every one of these guys in this band are really really great um and again the music video was fantastic in itself 
uh, it just, just <laughs> it just enhanced what was already an incredible song. And uh, my goodness, I there's not a bad thing that I can say about this song. The only thing that I can say was definitely worth the wait for the couple of the weeks. And I'm really glad that I didn't listen to that little kind of preview uh, and all that to it, just in case there was any kind of spoiler to the song or anything in it. So uh, I'm really glad I waited. It was definitely worth the wait. And I'm so excited to listen to, you know, more Sabaton songs down the line. And I'm really hoping that they come out with more songs too, because hopefully this is kind of hinting at, you know, maybe a new album that's coming out soon and, uh, and all that. So fingers crossed, that's what it is. And fingers crossed, we'll have more songs to listen to soon. But guys, thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Hopefully you enjoyed the song. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to drop a like and we'll see you guys next time.